we need to find the value of y in this exponential to logarithmic equation. Let's find the value of y. Solution. We need to simplify the left hand side by adding the exponent. So we reduce the base to 2 at the left hand side. And we multiply the exponent at the left hand side. Let's consider taking the log of both sides. So we try to bring down the exponent to the base from the left hand side. So over here we divide both sides by log 2. Let's simplify 400 log 400. So after this, we can now apply the log identity of addition. We can as well split log 100. Here we can simplify log 100, likewise log 4. Then we can split this expression, likewise bring this exponent down to the base. So from this part where we split, we can apply the log identity of addition.
we can as well split these. So we need to split, we need to simplify log 50 as so if we had these two together, 2 plus 1, we have So we simplify this as well using the log identity. Then we simplify log 25 as 5 to the power of 2. We can as well split this This give us one. Then we need to bring this exponent down to the base here. So if we add this three plus one, we have four. Likewise, we decide to simplify this with the change of base. From this step, we have We need to find the value of y, so we divide both sides by 4. This implies the value of y, which we need to find. Let's verify this value.
So from here, we can substitute the value of y. Using the exponential identity, so we can use it to simplify this left hand side. Two year one, two year two. 4 times 1, we have 4, 2 to the power of 4. The remaining 2 over here, we have it here. Now from this step, we can bring these 2 to the exponent of 5. If we use this identity, the identity say we are going to have B as our answer. We can use it to simplify this part of the expression. Then we are going to have 2 to the power of 5. Two to the power of four give us sixteen. Two five to the power of two we have twenty five. If we multiply sixteen by twenty five, we are going to arrive at four hundred. So as you can see. The left hand side is equal to the right hand side and that is proof and verified.